Where are you going? Maurizio, can you sum up what you saw from the director's box today? Sorry? Can you just sum up what you saw from the director's box today? Can you analyse what you saw today from where you were sat? Well, it's really tough to be there. To be honest, I don't want to be anymore there. Uh, it's, it's so frustrating to be there and try to connect with the, with the coaching staff downstairs. Um, no, I think it was really tough because you cannot show your emotion. Uh, yes, it's really frustrating and yeah, very disappointing. I think we are talking about the performance, so disappointed with the, with, the, with the performance. I think we never... We were connected with the with the game. Even when we scored uh, the goal, I think was a moment to to go, you know, for the for the game. And but the team never was with the right energy to go and to compete in our best way. Simon, two questions, Mr. Shelley. Are you more angry or are you more disappointed given the pre-international break Man City performance? And secondly. Why are Chelsea conceding so many goals in the six Premier League games without a clean sheet? We sort of saw the, the man of the goals today must have been particularly disappointed. Is it only two questions or more two, questions? Two questions. First question is, are you more angry or disappointed? Second question is, the, the oh, I think both, disappointed and angry. I think it's normal. You blame yourself when this, this type of performance happens and we need to blame ourselves. And then, uh, why we concede? Why is there so many goals being conceded in the last few games? No clear. Well, I think no one talking after Manchester City. We concede four like Manchester City. But of course, when you the type of uh, amount of goal that we are conceding is because uh, we need to yes to to be more um, focus and concentrate. I think today we concede so easy goals. And that is why I am so disappointed with that because it's a thing that we. Always we talk and we try to be, you know, solid in our defensive line. And but I think it's not only the defensive line of the keeper. It's about the it's about our performance, like a group, like a like a like a team. And the supporting with with our performance, I think was our worst our worst game than of the season. And yes, it's about to blame ourselves. Really sure we, we disappointed with the captain and his teams and the manner of standing up. Two you are disappointed. Were you disappointed in the manner of his? Yeah, disappointed. Look, this type of thing happened in football. Um, yes, of course, disappointed because uh, we should be finished with eleven players. But that is that happened in the in football. We need to accept this type of situation. Thiago Silva's mistake. Captain sent off the most experienced player. The goal away. Yeah, but that is about mistake. It's not. I am not talking about mistake. I talk more about energy and more about we were not in the right. Uh, we not prepare ourselves in the best way to compete today. That is is my uh, concern. I thought or we thought that we were ready to compete today, but we we didn't. We didn't compete in the way that the the competition is demanding. I think even if Newcastle wasn't great. I think it was a, a, an easy win to prepare the Champions League today. Rather to come here, Chelsea, and to, sh to show that it's going to be difficult for them to, to play, to win the game and to beat us, I think it was so easy in the way that we considered, in the way that we were, we were so soft in every single challenge. I think, you know, we didn't show that, that we were playing for something important. That is, is what why made me angry and disappointed and even if we talk about that if we are a young team and we need to learn, yeah, I think this type of games um, make me very, 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 very angry because it's about to show more personality and character and, and to, okay, we are young, but we are young like a team, but um, in we cannot miss this type of opportunity to show our best. We cannot be, uh, came from Tottenham City, if, uh, around the world, people price, you know, Chelsea. And then, okay, I stopped one step before. I don't do the effort. I didn't do the effort in the right moment. Okay, no problem. He's going to fix my, the, my teammate in behind. That is the problem. That we need to be more solid in, in this area. Mental, of course. And I don't. I want to say attitude because it's not attitude. It's about to be more show more strength in our mental game 
and be ready to compete, that it is not the same that play football. I can play football, you can play football, but to compete is about to be ready to compete, and today we, we didn't. Okay, we can do two more before we end, Paul, and then let's finish. So what's the sense? You talked about the mentality there of the players. What's the sense when you look at the team? No, mentality about the... We include uh, the coaching staff eh, and the staff also. All, all collectively, yes. Collectively, but in terms of the players, when the players looked at the team sheet and they knew that Newcastle has 13 players unavailable, they have three goalkeepers on their bench. So was there a sense that, you know, a little bit of overconfidence here and, and we can, you know, we can actually... Well, that is about to be mature. That is that is about to be mature and to and, and to know that even and because you cannot see the opponent, you cannot you know care about the opponent. You need to go and compete in your best, and that is the problem that today we didn't show this this uh, this capacity to compete. Even if, of course, the team that you know was today again in front of us was a, a very good team, but of course it's not. If three keepers on the bench or no, it's about in the way that we compete. So soft for us, we didn't show that we were competing for for some uh, for something very important.